Angry at U.S. neutrality in the British-French conflict, the French had attacked a number of American ships. It was a big problem for President John Adams. The French keep attacking American ships. What shall I do? I must send smart diplomats to negotiate with French Foreign Minister Charles Maurice de Talleyrand Perigord. We are three smart diplomats. We want to negotiate. They send us to France. My dream has come true. Surely Charles Pigney, John Marshall, and Elbridge Jerry will successfully negotiate. Well, what are you waiting for? Get to work. Consider it must be tested. This is cool. Dude, we're like diplomats. Here come the foreign ministers, representatives. Let's report to them as X, Y, and Z. So you want us to leave your ships alone? Ah! Yes, we do. How much? I'd say pretty much. Enough to offer us a bribe. Give us hell. France is a powerful country. You better pay. We'd rather fight an expensive war than pay you some stupid crime. We say millions for defense, not one cent for tribute. You be sorry. When Americans got word of how disrespectfully they'd been treated by the French, many wanted to go to war. George Washington was ready to come out of retirement to lead the army. Adams, however, tried further negotiation, and this time, France treated America seriously. The XYZ Affair, so named because that's how Americans referred to the French representatives who demanded a bribe, showed the world that the United States demanded to be treated with respect.